All right, for your demonstration, this is what I'll be looking for. You'll have uh, nine steps to go through, and I want you to call off each step. So step number one is going forward, and the forward contactor energized, the forward light energized. Then you hit stop one. Step two is reverse. Pushing the reverse button, the reverse light is on, the reverse contactor is on, pushing stop two. Next step, we're going to test OL forward. So we're pushing forward and reach over here and push on the forward contactor overload test. Then we're going to do the same thing for reverse. Push overload reverse, the reverse light is on, and I push the reverse contactor overload. Next we're going to do is test the overload, not the overload, the forward limit switch. So I push that. And then I'm going to test the reverse switch first. Nothing should happen. And then the forward. Got it. Now we're going to do the same thing for the reverse side. Push the reverse start. Push the forward limit. Nothing happens. The reverse limit. Everything stops. All right, now we're going to test the forward interlocks. Push forward. Now I'm going to push reverse and I got to listen to see if I hear anything, any kind of chattering or anything. Dead quiet, so we're good. Push stop one. Okay, reverse interlocks. Again, we'll push reverse. You're going to listen. Nothing. Okay, so we're good there. And we're going to stop. Now, one more thing. We want to push the forward. And now push stop two to make sure both of your stop buttons are wired in series. That's good. And if you want to throw an additional reverse and stop one. That concludes the physical demonstration. And then the next part will be showing your wiring on your three phase. Thank <laughs> you.